HugoRivera.net and today I want to talk about the biggest mistakes that people make when they are training biceps this little muscle over here well some people like Ronnie Coleman for example you cannot say that they have a little muscle but <laughs> most of us mere mortals don't have a, an arm that big at any rate the biggest mistake that I see people when it comes to building their biceps is that they use way too much uh, weight when they're doing an exercise and as a result when they're doing something as simple as a biceps curl which should just basically be a small movement like this just simply moving your forearm across this angle over here all right should be just a movement like that what i see people doing a lot is doing a whole bunch of jerky motions and going even like that to where you're activating the lower back muscles you're activating the shoulders and as a result you do not get to put the stimuli on the biceps where, where is uh, the muscle that you're trying to build. So the key thing I would advise is to go ahead and just check the ego by the door and uh, simply just put a weight that you can go ahead and do, uh, really focusing on squeezing the bicep and putting the tension on the muscle. That's what bodybuilding is all about. It's not about moving the biggest weight you can move from A to B. It's about taking that weight and stressing the muscle that you want to go ahead and uh, make bigger. That's mistake number one. Mistake number two is doing way too many sets for, for the biceps. The bicep is a small muscle that is activated when you do exercises like for the back and even shoulder exercises like the upright rows for example. So therefore you don't really need a whole bunch of sets to get the biceps uh, to grow. Anywhere between as, as little as six sets, to be honest with you, to as much as uh, definitely no more than 12 sets and that's at the very high end uh, of volume. So if you have a really good fast recovery ability and you're genetically gifted on that end, you could get away with 12 sets. But uh, most people fare very well with 9 to 10, to be quite honest with you. Um, 6 is a good number if you're hitting the biceps after the back, because if you do back and biceps, you're really engaging the biceps a lot uh, during the back movements. And then after, after the back uh, workout, you really do not need to, to kill the biceps with something like 12 sets, for example. At any rate, if you need some uh, routines for biceps, please feel free to check out my site where I have many, many arm routines and, and many routines for any body part for that matter. And uh, if you like this video, um, then feel free to check out my website at hugorivera.net where I have many more videos like this one. And you can also sign up to my free newsletter where you get free tips on training, nutrition, and supplementation on a weekly basis. And in addition, as a gift from me to you, I give you a free ebook on how to get in shape when you sign up to my free newsletter. At any rate, I hope that you enjoyed this video. And until then, take care and train hard. <laughs>